Hello, hello everyone, I am Darkness and welcome to Final Fantasy Tactics, The War of the Lions. This is actually the, um, the version that, uh, is on PSP, um, PlayStation 3, I believe you can get it on PlayStation 3, I think, but it was released for PSP, PS Vita, and, uh, that's where you're supposed to go play it. Uh, I've got it. It's, it's not it's not emulated, so make sure that we got the legit game going on here uh, But thank you so much for joining leave a like if you're gonna think you you might like this This is a very story rich game and it very much departs from how Final Fantasy usually worked This was the first time that the story was very much grounded and the characters were very You'll see it's not like a normal Final Fantasy some after follow that followed after uh, took up the reins of something like this, but this one was the first of its kind really uh, as far as Final Fantasy went So yeah, definitely leave a like if you think you might like this But stick around for a few to see how the story really does progress I'm not gonna do a lot of different voices as I narrate and also if you're new You might want to subscribe because this is I don't know how and I'm gonna release series like this for retro game consoles so uh, but this is one of my favorite games of all time of all time so I definitely want to play it. Okay. I am er Erazlam, student of Ivalice's middle age. You are familiar with the War of the Lions, no? It was a bitter war of succession that rent the land of Ivalice in two. Here we first find mention of Delita Hyrule a hitherto for unknown young man, the hero who would draw the curtain on this dark act of our history. His is, a, his is a heroism of great renown, a story familiar to all who dwell within our land. Ah, but what the eye sees is oft times a mere fragment of the truth. There was another young man, the youngest of the house Beolv. Takes a second to remember how to pronounce it every time. Beolv. Long fame for producing leaders of knights and men. There is no official record of the role he played in history stage. However, according to the Durai papers, the existence of which became known to the public only this last year, they had long lain concealed in the church archives. This forgotten young man is in fact the true hero. The church maintains he was a heretic, an inciter of unrest and disturber of the peace. Which account is to be believed? Join me in my search to uncover the answer. Ah, but before we begin, might I ask you to share with me your name and the date of your birth? Oof, the, the language is a little different than I'm used to, so yeah, of course I'm going to keep it as Ramza. Ramza Beolv. Uh, and I'll put my birthday though, so that's cool. Now you know my birthday. That's that's cool. There's gotta be a lot of the since this is the War of the Lions version, there are cutscenes that are put in. You can skip them if you want to, but I I like the animation style, so. It's a really good game. Stick with it, please.
It seems like a long, long, long montage for just writing up there, but it's... It means something. O oh, Father, abandon not your wayward children of Ivelis, but deliver us from our sins, that we might know salvation. Lady Ovelia, it is time. I'll not be much longer, Agrius. Your escort has already arrived, Majesty. Please, heed the good lady's words, Highness. You must hurry. Still in here, are you? It's been the better part of an hour. Gafgarion, you forget yourself, sir. You're in the presence of a princess. Mayhap bowed heads would less offend. You would do well to waste less time on idle pleasantries. I see even the noble order of the northern sky cannot rid itself of vulgar knaves. A guard captain in these rain-sodden hinterlands ought not expect chivalry. We are in the employ of the order, not of it. Our pay does not cover trite courtesies to the likes of you. Govern your tongue! They're going at it. Enough. Let us be on our way. The father watch over you, child. And you, elder. Uh-oh. Milady, the enemy is upon us. Duke Goltana's men. We are paid for this. Time to earn our keep. What is it, Ramza? You above getting paid to do a job? I'm a knight no longer, just another sellsword. Right then, to battle! Woo! Okay, the battles I'll keep in are the ones that actually, uh, deliver us, oh lord. The, the ones I'll keep in are the ones that actually have dialogue and are pivotal to the story. There's gotta be a lot that you guys probably will not see on screen because I don't power level, I just level up to the jobs I want and to the place I want so that when I get to the story, I can like massacre them and do like the extra dungeon and all that jazz. I love being able to do that. They bear the crest of the Black Lion. Duke Goltana must be mad. Does he mean to start a war? You there, wench! You cannot hope to defeat us. You will surrender the princess. If not, well, I would hate to see anything happen to that pretty face of yours. The way he lays his head back is so weird. A head-on assault! These swords of Galtana, lackwits one and all. In that case, we should be able to handle this without you, Gafgarion. Mayhap you could, but there's no money to be made in that. Lad, Ramza, with me! His name is Lad. Everyone else's name is like usually randomized, that if they're not like a, an actual main character. But... His name's Lad. Kill them all. Leave no man standing. You would have us slaughter them. Are you mad? Kill them here and you'll have played into Duke Goltana's hands. We need only to put them to rout. I find Denme dead men rout e more easily. He is not a good guy, just in case you're wondering. So, the style of combat in here, if you've watched anything that I've ever done, you're gonna know why I like this. It is strategic. You're trying to figure out exactly what they'll do, and then you make your move. Now, in this in particular, um, the... It's hard to know exactly what to do because you can get your butt handed to you really fast. On the other hand, he can get healed real fast and it'd be annoying. Ah, I didn't kill him. Well, I am in the middle of everywhere and will be killed if if not careful. Oh, she was going to take care of it. So usually you have control over a whole team, but in these beginning parts, 
there are many times where you're kind of put into the situation where the rest of the team is being taken care of for you. Uh, because you're supposed to be learning the game. I know this game like the back of my hand. <laughs> mostly. Um... And yeah, don't rend anything. You jerk. Of course you'd do that. Of course you're gonna do that. Why, wh why wouldn't you do anything else? Because you're a jerk. So, everyone has abilities and everyone has the abil uh, different classes. Um, and what they can and can't do it highly depends on their class and their subclass that you can get the, the, the abilities of another, another class under you. Um, for example, Lad is always a squire with white mage magic equipped to him. Now what will make you mad is thinking that uh, if you played the original on PS1, like Gafgarian's moves right there, you don't get access to them. And Agrius's moves, you can't just put on anyone. Um, if someone's watching this for the first time, I'm not going to expound upon that, but that's just not how it works. In this version, one of the things I will be doing fastest is getting the Black, uh, the Dark Knight class. Because it works and it works really well. And it gives you Gafgarian's moves. Most of them, at least. The ones that matter. The ones that really suck to have to not have in the game because they look cool and do good stuffs. But still, um, the story is played out in chapters. I think there's four, um, and it's definitely... If you can't tell, it's, it's about a war. Now, Ivalis, and I had to re-go look up the, how to pronounce, because Ivalis is how I always did it, but this game, in cutscenes, will pronounce it as, like, evil, like, and lease, like, not lice, uh, so Ivalis, and, um, and the last name of Ramza changed between versions, so, uh, Beolv is... Delita ends up saying it at some point in a cutscene. Um, that's how I got all those things. But geez, that's those are those are little things. And there are Easter eggs in this game. There are other Final Fantasy characters that show up in this game. One in particular that everyone about peed themselves when they found out about. So, oh, is that one of my, oh? That's one of mine down. That's why she's raising. Okay. I was about to say, why? She's just gonna make it drag out. Just attack him. He's the only one left. Yay, give me that heal. But kill him first. Just kill this guy, please. Oh, okay. No, heal me real well. And then we'll... we'll you'll see, and you're seeing exactly why I'm not going to leave in all of the battles. Um, just because... Um, it would be a very, very long playthrough if I did that. But there are some that they're, are critical to this story. And this is actually one of them. As you're about to see, as we get to towards the end of this. Because screw you, dude. Please die. She'll hit me if she has to. Okay. I was about to say, Agrius to end battles will hit you. She'll hurt you pretty fast to end it. Uh, it's done. Here's why it's important. The princess. 
This way. Be quick. And try making a little less noise. I'll not take orders from you! You've quite a mouth on you, princess. <gasps> Forgive me. Tis your birth and faith that wrong you, not I. I love that line. So, there's not really a good place for me to be able to pause it here. So I'm just holding it on this last screen and letting you guys know that I really do enjoy this game and I hope you guys stick with it long enough to get involved in the story because there are events that have to happen that'll take like four or five episodes before all of a sudden you see how complex the story is and how invested you can really get into it. So. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you thought down in the comments. If you liked it, leave that thumbs up and think about subscribing so you know when more come out because this is something I really do want to approach as I go into doing more retro games as well as current ones. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you back here for the next one really, really soon. Bye.